Hey everybody, welcome back to Wet the Face, and uh, I'm gonna be doing a review of one of my soaps. Um, you know, I uh, I do a lot of reviews uh, this year, and every year I make sure that I'm uh, I'm doing a video, I'm writing an article, and um, now I think I think what I'll do from now on is uh, maybe towards the end of the the year, like uh you know, December-ish kind of thing. Um, I'll be doing, you know, promoting some of my stuff. Um, it's only fair, right? <laughs> so, today we're going to be looking at Himitsu, which means secret. And I'm telling you, the scent on this is just, <laughs> I love it. Man, oh man, oh man. <laughs> So, you have patchouli, saffron, sweet lemon, and a touch of rose. Now, this is not an overbearing patchouli. Uh, it's mixed in such a way that the combination is just awesome. Really good. Um, so, what I'm going to do is uh, put this in a bowl, and uh, we'll lather it up, bring it to the face, and talk about the results. So, uh, let's do it. Don't go away. Okay, so here we have the bowl, and you can see it's empty. And uh, here's the soap in question. And let me just open this up so you can take a look at the texture of the soap. And you can see I could push my finger in there and leave a dent. So it's uh, you know it's a soft soap, not uh, it's not a puck or anything. So and I can kind of swish it around with my finger. So that's the texture of this soap. And I'm going to be using this tool. And we're going to bring it to the bowl and then start the lather. So let's get to it. Okay, so here you see the bowl has the soap in it now. And I will be taking my uh, brush and soaking it with warm water. I'm going to put not the whole thing in, but a little bit at a time. The way I do it with uh, my soaps is I put a little bit of water in uh, at a time as needed. So I'm going to start right now. And that is the first stage. And here we go. As you can see, it's starting to make a beautiful lather right now. Peaks are starting to happen already. And that scent is coming out. It is a great scent. Whoa, look at that lather. <laughs> okay, I just <laughs> look at that. Holy shit. Okay, so we'll take this to the face and uh, we'll do the shave. <laughs> okay, I've had about uh, three or four days worth of growth, so let me wet my face. And um, here is the lather. <laughs> Look at that craziness. All right, so I'm going to attempt to put this on my face without dropping one bit on my shirt. <laughs> okay, here we go. <laughs> oh, well. <laughs> wow, that is creamy.
Wow. The scent is just, just phenomenal. I love this scent. And you can see it has great coverage and a very creamy texture. Look at that. <laughs> all right. <laughs> I do have it all over my shirt, so <laughs> I can't hide it. Um, so. Here is the razor and let's do the shave. <laughs> Another great shave. Hmm. Not a nick. So, can't really score my own uh, shaving soap. That wouldn't be fair. Uh, but uh, I do say I had a great shave. And uh, everything is great. Slickness glide, pull shave feel, phenomenal. I love it. So, Hamitsu doesn't have an aftershave yet, but um, it's coming soon. And uh, right now, I'm going to put on Clean Vetiver from Fine. And you know, Fine, uh, they have raised their prices to quite a, to a, quite a bit. And it might be out of the reach of a lot of people. And um, this does pair very well with Hamitsu. But um, it's a shame because I probably, I probably won't buy their aftershaves anymore because it'll just be too expensive. It's a shame. But, you know, I'm sure he has his reasons on raising his price. You know? But, um, I had a great shave. And I hope you have a great shave too. And I'll see you soon.